On the moon is a computer that downloads this laser beam with your consciousness on it, downloads it and puts it into an avatar. An avatar that looks just like you. Handsome, strong, beautiful, whatever, and immortal. And you can walk on the moon. He said immortal. Now, people are so dumbed down today, family, that they don't know that they are already immortal. They have dumbed the world down for the past couple thousand years to prepare them for this moment. All of the religion that they gave us for the past 7,000 years is what I call flesh and bone religion. These are religions that teaches people they were born into a world inside of flesh and bone. When actually, you're not flesh and bones on top of a globe. You are a soul inside of a simulated universe right now as I speak to you. We're in a holographic light-based reality. We can't perceive it as such because we are uh, programmed to experience the simulation as physical. Okay? Now check how deep this is. Once they through religion, they've convinced the whole world for the past couple of thousand years that we are mortals and that the immortals are the gods in Olympus. Once they convinced us that we were mortals, we abandoned our ancient spiritual teachings that said we were always eternal beings. When we forgot that, they can promise you something you already got now. Let me say that again. When you forgot that, they can promise you something that you already have, which is immortality. But when they say immortality, what they're saying is eternal enslavement. Let me say it again. When they say immortality, they're talking about a slave that can't die. Yo, harvesting slaves is a very tough process. Any slave owner would like an eternal slave that don't die. That's a no-brainer. 